Mr. Charles, I want you to write down everything you can see. because he doesn't like the movie or the serial. That is probably the stupidest thing I've ever heard today and ever in my entire life and from anyone around the whole entire... That's exactly what happened. Did you hear something? Sorry, that was a serial. How did this happen? First, the killer walks up to him, pushes him on the ground, takes the funnel, pours the cereal down the funnel, and kills him. I don't think that's what happened, but what I think happened is he tripped over his own feet with his mouth, mouth facing the funnel, and then he it went down his throat and he choked on it. again. Quiet, you. Looks like someone likes to duck juggle sandbags to death. I think the killer stole his glasses and dropped sandbags on That's a little dark for a movie screening in the series. Why are you a detective enough to be a detective? Looks like we have a clear case of axe to the back. I think the sample girl gave him a free sample of axe. He's free Hi, free sample of axe? Sure. <coughs> axe deodorant, excite. Woman will chase you down the street. It's true. <coughs> Your commercial stink. He's free too much. It got in his mouth. He choked and tripped on an axe planted there by the killer. Don't stop talking. I am going to send you back to Police Academy. Do you want to go back to Police Academy? Actually, I do. There's more I can learn. I think he was the one who directed the movie, and he had to drink all the coffee that all the directors drink, and then the coffee was too strong for him, and so he just passed out on the floor and died. Okay, what about the broken neck? And what about this movie review card that says this was the best movie I ever saw? It should win an Oscar. You know what, just, just go, just go home. You're fired, just leave. Now on to the last one. Wait, where is it? Well, your 
probably wondering why I'm a ghost and an alien. Well, good night, everyone.